person now, uh, which kind of like I kind of got my name from, is the name of Scratchmatic. Gotcha. So, so he was a local legend, but he was one of the like, but he was also like an LA. Uh, he was a local legend where I, where I grew up, uh, at a place called Cerritos, which is like a uh, suburbia, in, uh, thirty minutes away from LA, but in okay. LA County and stuff. Okay. So, but he was kind of like one of the first. I want to say they're there at the DJ Battles. It was a, so Radio, Radiotron. Yeah, of course. So radio, you, you, if you that's guys the break dancers, radio, right? Yeah, so that's like we're Badass. basically we're the movie Breaking, kind of based upon yeah. that miracles and shit like that. Uh-huh. So Radiotron was is is the, he used to he entered a battle over there and won the first DJ battle. So he changed his name for his name his original name was Anthony, and. That's and they changed his name from Scratchmatic. They named him Antron and stuff like that. So how I got the name Ripmatic, Curse used to kind of like, he wasn't going by Curse at the time, but um, the Curse used to go like, like yo, Ripmatic. Rip I was like, my 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 old DJ name was Fix, P-H-I-X. That was my graffiti name. But I, so I was like, might as well call myself DJ Wicked. Fix. Okay, okay. Right? And, and, and then he go, you know, he used to go, yo, Ripmatic. Ripmatic, said, don't call me that, dude. I want Scratchmatic to think I'm biting and, you know, whatever like that. But but it just kind of stick because at the same time too, Repmatic was like, what is, what is a Repmatic? Sounds like a refrigerator name and shit like that. It was you know so. So that's how that's, the name came about. That's how the name came about. That's because so. I've always fucking wondered. <laughs> so Rhett, okay, so this is when you get into, this is where the, all the Filipino <laughs> Filipino right. thing came out. So my parents, you know, if you know, a lot of Filipinos are are Catholics. So right. My birth name is Nazareth, like Jesus of Nazareth. <laughs> so they, you know, so then I was like Rhett. So they named me. So Rhett is my other real name or nickname, whatever we want to call it. Mm-hmm. Uh, Rhett spelled R H E T T, right? Yeah. They got that name from Rhett Butler, the character from Gone with the Wind, because that's their favorite movie, right? So yeah. here's the Filipino logic. If you got, you know, so. <laughs> So, so I because I, I used to hate my name when I was growing up because everybody would fuck up my name all the time and shit or like what the hell is this you know like you know you know now, now I'm happy that you know I got you know I got an original name but back then you know you know kids were like they you know, oh ruthless are, man ruthless man they used to <laughs> lazy and ruthless man they oh used my to God. fuck my, I fucked my name up so much and used to, I used to get traumatized about that shit oh mate like, trust me I feel, I feel you kids are horrible. So, yeah, man. So, so uh, um, they, you know, they don't know what Nazareth is, and then when they said Rhett, they were like wreck, rich, 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 rich. I was like fuck, you know. So, anyways, I would ask. I, I want. I remember asking myself. So, how did you like? Why did you name me Nazareth? Well, Rhett, because you know we pray to God if if you uh, if Lord if you give us a baby boy, we will name you after your birthplace. Jesus. Jesus and that. I was like, <laughs> I gave this. So he gave us a boy. So I was like, okay. So well, how'd you get red? Well, our, pra- our favorite movie was God with the Wind. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> so red, but, like, but mom, dad, like red, it, it doesn't, it doesn't spell the right way. You know, Nazareth, Nazareth, you know, Nazareth, yeah, Nazareth. Yeah. It's like, but it rhymes. <laughs> Nazareth, red. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's it works. If, it works, you know. Got, if, if people want to understand how Filipino cultures and all that stuff, if, watch comedian Joe Coy on Netflix. Joe Coy. Uh, yeah, you would. You, he talks about it. Filipino man. Every every Filipino moms, any whether Fili- any yeah. Filipinos can tell you that's how Filipino moms are. That's. Yeah. The logic and all that shit. You know. <laughs>